If you've ever taken a trip and stayed the night or even spent a day out in the wild, you know that having a dog makes you feel a lot safer. Not all dogs are suited for the wild or can provide the protection that you would need. So which dog breed is best for wilderness survival? Due to the different climates that you may live or adventure in, it's hard to choose just one breed that's the best. In this video, we've listed the 10 best dog breeds for wilderness survival. Number 10, Alaskan Malamute. One of the oldest Arctic sled dogs, the Alaskan Malamute was first bred in Alaska to carry large loads over long distances. A majestic, dignified breed, the Malamute is highly intelligent and learns quickly, but he also can be strong-willed. Loyal, devoted, and highly athletic, he's an affectionate family companion that enjoys outdoor activities. Number nine, Akita. The Akita is a large breed that's not too fond of strangers, but is very affectionate with their owners and their family. When appropriately trained, they will only be wary of and threatening to strangers that seem to be dangerous or intimidating. They're best for cooler weather or cold climates, as they can quickly overheat if they become overexerted in the summertime or in high temperatures. Number eight, Norwegian Elk Hound. The Norwegian Elk Hound is a hunting breed that was originally developed for pursuing elk, bear, and other formidable prey. An extraordinarily strong dog breed, the Elk Hound needs the chance to burn off plenty of energy every day. They thrive best in large outdoor areas where they can freely roam. A true outdoor dog breed, the Norwegian Elk Hound prefers hanging out outdoors rather than lounging on the couch, and they'll quickly become frustrated if forced to spend their lives indoors. Number seven, German Shepherd. German Shepherds also tend to love spending time outdoors, and they're well suited for a variety of climates. They're eager to please and easy to train, which is why they're often utilized as police dogs, service dogs, agility dogs, confirmation animals, obedience dogs, and sentinels. Though the German Shepherd dog is a lovable breed, they don't give affection lightly. As a one-man breed, however, they display serious loyalty to their owner or primary caretaker. Number six, Cane Corso. At a glance, the Cane Corso may appear intimidating, but he's all heart and responds to love and rewards far better than harsh corrections. He's intelligent, loyal, eager to please, and versatile. Cane Corso are also a protective breed and were bred to work and are happiest when they have a job to do. Many Cane Corso compete in agility, obedience, dock diving, protection sports, and tracking events. Number five, Rottweiler. While Rottweilers love being outside, they don't like to be separated from their families. Rottweilers are hardworking, strong, and loyal people dogs. Despite their imposing manner, they're often described as goofballs by their enthusiasts. Though silly and affectionate with those closest to them, they're also territorial. Rottweilers are also extremely intelligent, highly trainable, and thrive when working alongside their human partners. This is why they make exceptional therapy, search and rescue, and police dogs. Number four, Bernese Mountain Dog. A very comfortable animal in somewhat colder climates, the Bernese Mountain Dog hails from the farmlands of Switzerland. They worked as farmhands, cattle herders, cart pullers, and watchdogs. They're a bit on the larger side of the spectrum and are sturdy enough to weather a bit of snowfall. Despite their size, these dogs typically have calm and happy dispositions, though they can be trained to protect both their owners. Just keep in mind that these dogs are not suited for hot desert climates as they have very thick coats. Number three, Australian Cattle Dog. The Blue Heeler actually has wild dingo blood in their genetic heritage. These dogs are working dogs to their core, born and bred for herding and hunting and running and defending for hours and days upon end. This makes the Blue Heeler a perfect choice for wilderness survival. These dogs are very smart and take well to training, but they're also bred to be independent thinkers that could be wary of strange people. Number two, Rhodesian Ridgeback. Hailing from South Africa is named for a ridge of hair that runs along their back in the opposite direction as the rest of their fur. The Ridgeback is excellent for exploring the outdoors and have been used to hunt for large, dangerous game, including lions. They're great for most outdoor activities and are extremely athletic. They're noted as excellent guard dogs, though some say they're not necessarily the best option for first-time dog owners as they require positive, reward-based training in order to be properly socialized. Number one. Belgian Malinois. The first thing you should understand about the Belgian Malinois, they're very hardcore survivors. They only overheat when exhausted in extreme heat and only struggle in the cold when it's under 10 degrees Fahrenheit. 
Although they're extremely protective of their owner and their family, they don't do well with intimidation. They make excellent watchdogs, perfect for nights out in the middle of nowhere, and can be trained to protect you while you're sleeping or if you're being attacked. So I really hoped you enjoyed this video. Now, a question for you. What kind of dog would you take with you on a wilderness adventure? Let us know in the comments. And here are some other cool videos I know you'll enjoy. See you guys later.